on to some news from Abu Dhabi. Nine months after Prime Minister Modi inaugurated the temple in Abu Dhabi, the Bab's Hindu Mandir is making headlines. It has been named the best cultural project across MENA or Middle East North Africa of 2024. Not just that, Bab's Temple has also been honored with the best cultural project in the UAE. The Bab's Hindu Mandir was recognized because of its standout architecture, cultural significance, as well as its contribution to the society. More specifically, the temple was lauded for its engineering ingenuity, innovation and sustainability. The awards, which are recognized as a gold standard for excellence in the MENA region, conferred the title on the temple. That's huge, especially when the awards received over 40 nominations across various categories. Accepting the recognition, the head of the Bab's Hindu Mandir, Pooja Brahma Vihari Swami, spoke from India and highlighted why the project was significant. He said that these awards underscore the unity and harmony it symbolizes. Besides the technical and agricultural brilliance of the temple, just for some background here, the Bab's Hindu Mandir was first inaugurated on February 14, 2024. It is reportedly the first Hindu temple in the West, in, in uh, the first Hindu temple in West Asia to be built using traditional Indian techniques. The temple incorporates over 30,000 intricately carved stone pieces, a testament to its design and craftsmanship. It is built according to ancient Hindu Shilpa Shastras, ancient texts that describe design and principles for a wide range of arts and crafts. The temple is also a rare mix between traditional Indian artistry and Arabic motifs. It stands as a symbol of cross-cultural harmony. And what's more, it's also the region's biggest temple and the largest Hindu temple in the whole of West Asia. It can accommodate between 8,000 to 10,000 people. As for how this temple adds to the ties between India and the UAE, you see at the very outset, the project's advancement was closely overseen by the leadership of both India and the UAE. Several ministers, in fact, frequented the site to provide support to the temple's foundation. In fact, just a few days back, India's external affairs minister, Dr. S. J. Shankar, also paid a visit. He had called it a true symbol of India and UAE friendship, peace, harmony and goodwill around the world. At the time of its inauguration, Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi had thanked the President of the UAE for gifting the piece of land where the temple now stands. Prime Minister Modi had hailed the temple for fostering stronger ties between India and the other side. To stay up to speed with the latest news, download the Weon app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.